We can't afford to be so reckless, Jakaro. Losing Theron is bad enough. What if we lost you too? Now, now, everyone, stay calm. Queen Lena of Onderon once faced a similar predicament, and her solution was quite creative. Shut up, droid! What's going on? Where's Theron? He was captured. The Nova Blades data listed a Revenite safe house here in town, and when we tried to investigate... <laughs> Theron is the only one the Revenite saw. They may not know about the rest of us. If so, we need to maintain that advantage. If we move quickly, we may be able to catch up before the Revenites disappear again. They already have. Please, this is not the time for reckless heroics. I really think you're all much too worried. They took him alive! That's a good sign. They're probably just torturing him a bit. Maybe doing some interrogation, where he could tell them about us. Oh no! Th that won't be an issue. Theron has several discrete implants to help him ignore pain and chemical manipulation. What if Revan or one of his followers used the Force? Couldn't they read his mind? I've never been able to... Yes, I've tried. I'm sure it's no surprise. Theron's mind is highly ordered, very resolute, probably due to his childhood training by the Jedi. He'll keep our secrets and we will rescue him. But right now, we need to focus and think it all through, just like he would. You're right. We need to stick to the mission. When we find the Revenites, we'll find Theron. Precisely. If we're fortunate, he may even learn a bit about their plans. Now, what did you learn from the Mandalorians? Revan has a hidden fleet here on Rishi. He's preparing for some kind of battle. A hidden fleet? Pirates altering shipping lanes. That's it. They aren't just affecting the shipping lanes, they're also changing Imperial and Republic patrol paths. Revan is trying to draw them into a battle. Here, over Rishi. With his own ships in the mix, both fleets could be devastated. That must be his goal. Weakening both sides so that he can make his own play. We have to find some way to interfere. I know where to find them! <coughs> After they caught Theron, I intercepted their transmissions. After that, triangulating their base was a simple calculation. I completed it almost 87 seconds ago. They're on a small island not far from here. The native Rishi have a trading village on the same island. I'm sure they'd give us comfortable lodging. Then let's go. We need to clean up any trail we might have left here. You go on, we'll meet you shortly. Oh, I used to love cleaning. All right, you're here. You got us. Who in blazes are you, anyway? Let's just say I enjoy exercising the freedoms the Republic provides. The Republic is nothing but a tapestry of lies. Revan has shown us that. We've sworn to overthrow the governments who've kept the galaxy divided for so long. To end this war. How can you possibly justify standing in our way? You're betraying your own people and getting a lot of them killed in the process. Why? Because some crazy guy in a mask said to? Revan sees through the lies. He knows how to save the galaxy. From what? War? Revan's been fighting this war for centuries. He's obsessed with it. This guy says he's gonna save us all. But he is manipulating and killing an awful lot of people along the way. Will there be anyone left to save when he's done? I... I don't know. What do you want from me? Huh? Why are you saying all of this? You can help me stop this madness before anyone else gets hurt. There's another camp nearby. Help me break up their forces. The less support Revan has, the less damage he can do. The former Imperials? You really are crazy. <laughs> you know what? I'm in. Anyone else? We've got your back, Cap. Be just like old times. You give us a signal, we'll charge in with everything we've got. Glad to hear it.
Tell me your name. I like to know who I'm about to kill. Captain Milanek. Don't be ridiculous. I know the man. He's... Changing sides again, Captain? I always knew you were too weak to carry our fight to its end. Insults make for hollow last words, Ivris. It's over. There's no point in more fighting. No, I suppose not. We'll keep them under watch and hold down the camp. We can fake the security check-in so no one notices. At least for a while. Also, we got something interesting out of one of the Sith guards. Here. Coordinates for the bunker where your pal Theron's being held. Good work. Thanks. Good luck to you. And in. Theron's toys make all of this slicing much simpler than I'd imagined. Can you find any hard data on his location? Let's see. Here we are. Recorded interrogation sessions. Coordinates are included. I'll forward them along. What about Revan? No information either way. I'd advise caution. ปาเทโทกะกอวาตาเจลาวาคาเนเฮกวาบาเฮโคคาซามาเนโฮฮามะนีวุนคาวาซาวูบอฟวอยดาควิมโยยาฟาเดฮียะ <laughs> I don't know if you can read me, but I've arrived. We read you. Would anyone like some refreshments? We have several fine beverages available. No, thank you. I'm fine. All right. Off to a good start. What's with all the sour faces? Somebody start a war or something? Not helping. The Revanite ships have all been scattered, captured, or destroyed. Their accomplices aboard our vessels are in chains. You found a threat and given us the means to root it out. Separately, what do we have to discuss? Revan is still alive, my lord, and his plans don't stop here. The Emperor is not dead. Revan thinks he can fix that, but he's wrong, isn't he? No one person, not even Revan, can truly destroy the Emperor. Revan isn't exactly alone in this. We've stopped a lot of his followers, but who knows how many more he's got. It doesn't matter. They will fail, and we will all suffer for it. The Emperor's current state is nebulous, incorporeal. To strike at him, Revan will first have to return him to a physical form. Which is exactly what the Emperor wants. He will destroy Revan, then move on to the rest of us. In time, he will consume all life in the galaxy. How do we prevent it? How do we stop Revan? The Emperor's hideaway is a secret, even to the Dark Council. The fourth moon of Yavin. That's where we'll find Revan. He wanted me to join him there. Never said I couldn't bring a few friends. According to our data, he still has extensive forces at his disposal. We would stand a better chance of overcoming them together. No matter what evidence I present, I doubt the Supreme Chancellor will agree to any kind of alliance or truce. Neither will the Dark Council. But my ships and the soldiers aboard them are loyal to me. I can convince my troops to maintain a truce. They've seen Revan's threat firsthand. 
Next stop, Yavin 4. Very well. Theron. We can talk on the way to Yavin. I have some business to finish here. Thank you for your help. All of you. This can't have been easy. The conspiracy is finally exposed. We've been hiding our actions from our allies for so long, it's a relief to have everything in the open. So we can talk about how you threw me to the wolves now? I made a calculated strategic decision, and it worked, as we can all see now. And if you had talked to me about it, I would have volunteered, but you didn't even give me a choice. We couldn't risk the Revenites knowing that your capture was a ploy. You had to be in the dark for the plan to work. Farron had a right to know the danger he was going into, Lana. You should never have hidden the truth from him. Or the rest of us. The ends have clearly justified the means. Personal feelings are irrelevant next to that. I think it's time we moved on. Yavin is a long way from here. Agreed. Let's get moving. It's been too long since we really talked, Theron. Can you stay for a while? Of course. Have a safe trip to Yavin! Guess you'll think twice next time a spy asks you out for a quick chat. Wouldn't want to go through all this again. Are you kidding? This is the most fun I've had in a long time. I don't know if I'd go that far, but good company helps. I may have mentioned this before, but I've never been much of a team player. Things usually go better for me when I'm on my own. Relying on someone else has been interesting. Beginning to think I should have started a long time ago. If you ever get tired of that government salary, give me a call. Will do. Anyway, thanks. Working with you has made all this madness worthwhile. The feeling is mutual. Glad we're on the same page. Come on, let's go see what Yavin has in store for us. <laughs>